I'm back with another review of a new model. This is the Custom 67 Pontiac Firebird. This one is in the last case for 2017, so it's the one of the final new models to show up for 2017. Uh, this was in the Q case, which is the last case for 2017, and it is the Custom 67 Pontiac Firebird. It is in the Muscle Mania series. And this one was designed by Brendan Vitusky. And uh, this is actually modeled after his own car, his own project that he's been working on. And uh, this, this is before he put the hood on it. So if we turn it up here, you will notice that it does uh, have an exposed engine there. The hood has not been added at this point, um, but as you will see in the picture of his real car, uh, he does have the hood now, but this is a an exact replica of his, or his before it was uh, finished. And his own car, he has, uh, it is clear coated over bare metal, and this Hot Wheels edition uh, you have the bare metal body there as well and in Usually they call this a Zamac uh, Which is a has been a Walmart exclusive most of the time, but this one showed up in an international case It's not a Walmart case uh, So this one has that same uh, Zamac Lack of paint job I guess you would say um, but that's to match the the actual uh, bare mo bare metal clear coated vehicle of his. Uh, you do have the circle there painted in black on the side, and we'll try to come up just a little bit here, get a little bit better view from a little bit higher. There we go. So now you can see this from another angle. Now, uh, Brendan was the designer of the Ice Charger uh, that was from the Fast and the Furious and the Gotta Go and a whole lot of Camaros. And that's not all. He's, he's designed quite a few vehicles in the main lines lately. Uh, I believe he's also worked on the Monster Jam line. And before that, he was working on some of the track sets. He's a talented designer, and not just on the Hot Wheels, but as you can see, on the real, uh, the real thing as well. So here's a, here's a look at his real life custom 67 Pontiac Firebird and you will notice that he does have the black hood uh, which was not showing up on the Hot Wheels version so here we come back to the Hot Wheels version and uh, this one's got OH5 wheels it's got light blue tinted windows and the spoiler is also painted black as well as some of the detail on the engine there. You can see all of that. That's black plastic there. The base on this one is also black plastic. And there in the back you see some air vents uh, right in front of the rear wheels. That's uh, to vent the brakes back there, the rear brakes. And it's got a pretty wide stance there. You see the tires sticking out just a little bit past the body itself. All in all, a very nice model. Um, his his real life car it uh, it has 553 horsepower at the crank and 442 horsepower at the wheels. and he occasionally takes it out to the track. On the secondary market, this one is going for five to eight dollars. So it is pretty new and probably the most popular model in the new Q case. 
so we'll see what happens as it becomes more available um, but all in all it's a great car great design really like this one thanks for watching